Hello, hello. I'm back again as Ashen Ninja with a dilemma. Do we take Treasury, a buttload of Chaos Corruption, or do we take a Safeguard? I'm going to take Safeguard. Of course. Alright, so they didn't actually come and attack here. Which is interesting. If I was them, I would have. But hey. See what we end up with. Now Malachi here, Light. he'll be doing a bunch of replenishment. But what we want to do is we want to go down and hit this one. Fallen ones, what's this? Dwelling building has been constructed, right? Anyway. Oh. Okay, not that big. Is he? He's like some sort of chaos dwarf. Something weird. Oh, we're gonna go grab this. There's nothing there, so that's fine. We're just gonna go straight in off the pipe, get ourselves another 500 grudges. Skull leaks. Uh, we'll repair that. Apparently, it got damaged. Hmm. Weird. Put in the growth building. We'll upgrade a carp. Oh no, we'll. we'll refrain from that for now, because what we need to do is go over here. We need to go over here to Luzgore Luz Farabra and see if we can swap him out with Thorgrim, which we can't. It's really weird how it does this. It won't let you replace a lord with one of the legendary lords. I don't really get it. So we recruit Thorgrim. Go over to Thorgrim. Drop off everything. There we go. We will go into Lazago. We're going to take away a couple of these items. Take away all of these ancillaries. We'll take all that off him. And we'll just disband him. Now we have a quick look at Mr. Grudge Bearer. So we've got... Dragon Crown, we'll take that. We've got the Axe of Grimna, we'll take that. And we've got the Armor of Skaldor, we'll take that. Now, it does mean he's not going to be hidden, which is a problem. We're going to give him that. He will be able to take on most enemies that come at him by himself, maybe. Give him a couple of things, we give him a Razor Standard. How do those work for him? Choir Master, Dwarf Bride, Tattooist. What else we got? Yeah, Guild Master, we've got a lot of Guild Masters now. Don't worry about that one, or that one, or a Slayer Ward. Teller of Tales, though, seems like a good option. Okay, we will give him a Jewel Master and a Miner then. Good. He is pretty friggin' tough though, and he now regenerates because of that, so. Yeah. Alright. Now, skill wise, we can give him Inspirational Leader from there. Be sure in presence, okay. We don't have anything here that'll lower. We'll give him that to start. He's got all of those. I think you can give him all, literally all of them. Drop us to all provinces is probably a good one to give him. Fire sports so we can get more engineers and whatnot, more runesmiths. High king is good. Uh, that's actually really good. Unbreakable when fighting against enemies with thousand plus grudges. Hmm. But what we will do is let's take ourselves and we're gonna grab this stuff. Dali firepower, I think it is, yep. That's good. We'll take ancient bloodline. Uh army side plot. Yeah, we'll take that as well, actually, because that's found really good. Uh, let's see. 
Yeah, we'll grab that. That and that. Uh, I haven't really been using the runesmiths. Though, 10% more oaf gold were on the map. Good. Alright, well, there you go. <laughs> so that's him sorted for the moment. We will grant him more gyrocopters. Probably better to give him a ground army. But oh well. We can give him a bunch more engineers if we wanted to. But we won't do that. Yeah, you're in a good spot, but yes, we'll give you more of that. Lord up here has not moved. I might just keep him there for a bit longer while we bring in the mighty uh, Grombrindle and his insane army of doom. Don't you move you. Now, what do we want to do here now? That could be good to get. We need to get the tool maker first, though. Hmm. Was it something here I was going for, though? No, income from all buildings plus 5% ain't exactly bad. Yeah, we'll go with go with that. Four oh, turns for that. What have we got? Uh, what army are you in? You're in Grumbrindle's army. We're gonna give you that so that you can also do restock. This should be a fun army to play with, I think. Just gotta get him into a decent battle. But for now. It is the end turn. Oh, the Grombrindle, I think, is the one we're going to want to fight the Magatost with as well. Or well, maybe not, actually. I actually reckon the, um, the Gyrocopters should do well against the Magatost. Now that I think about it. Because we can just avoid getting into melee with Tamakan and spend 8,000 years shooting at him. And that should be able to take him out. Uh, I'm trying to think of uh, the shooting that uh, a Nurgle army might have. Oh yeah, they, they might have the Exalted Plague Bearers that could actually do if they can do a fair bit of damage to us. He's, he's, oh, he came to, came to play, then he realised Grombrindle's just there. And decided against that. Probably wise. Ready. Let's see if we can find him, though. Yeah, he's hanging down just down there. Should be able to defeat this. He's got... I don't think he's got anything we're shooting. <laughs> Not a thing. Uh, let's have a look. Uh, we'll try and hide them somewhere up here. And hope for the best. Which is probably the best. So let's do that. We'll fight this manually. And hopefully we don't have to uh, do much of in the way of actual fighting with our heroes and lord. Let's just move the mic a bit because I've decided to sit differently and now I'm sitting differently again. So I'll move it back this way. Ah. Oh, and I've got the hiccups. Jeez. Now, technically, they have a very good army there. You could do to the centre. I'm just going to chuck our army like so. That doesn't seem right. Why is it doing that? Because the way it should be sorting it is so that they're in a certain order, but they're not, of course. All 
All right, let's start this one up. And what we want to do is we're going to take you to do that. You two, take that off and go hide in a far corner for me that I meant to put you in, but I didn't do a very good job of that initially. Hit those chariots, that's a good idea. Do I actually have any flyers? No. Good. Uh, target him, please. Not change over here. We're already doing a fair bit of damage. Friggin' hell look at the amount of damage that guy's taken already. That's good. Those doggos are going to run very soon. He's going to fall apart very soon. Already taking heinous casualties. Very good. Oh, they do have a flyer. disc so that makes him high priority kill pull them out please problem is the discs are very fast you fire at him as well if we can break him we can get rid of him that's good Oh. Get those chaos chariots, please. Drops away. Down. Fast. Fast. That's good. Yes. Let's change your. There. Nothing can stop us. Need to chase down these chariots. Chariots look like they might be finding our lord and heroes. That's bad. No, nope, they've turned around now. That's good. Hit these chaos trolls, please. Rather have him completely taken out. There we go, that's good. Sorted. He did a bit of damage. Go hit them, please. Oop. Victory's in our grasp, which is good, but. They're now starting to send a bunch of stuff towards our Lord and Heroes. So we've got to try and take out units like this one <laughs> and this one before they make it. I mean, our Lord should be able to actually kind of hold his own, but jeez. We don't want him to have to. Come on. Stay out. Charge. Oh, yep, 
their um Them, please. More hands as well. Kill everything. Somebody fire. Pick your targets well. Gonna be discovered very, very soon. <laughs> no, it looks like we might get the break on them. Yeah, there we go. They're shattering now. And we just need to take out the, um, the spawn now. That's good. Yes, yes. Hidden units are revealed. Come the gyros. Right. Now I'm on. Just got a couple more to kill. Maybe just one more even. There we go. Nice, nice. Nice, nice. No valiant defeats to be had here. Six losses because of their flying hero. And one other one. So that must have been some friendly fire. So that was him. Exalt hero is the enter. Probably should have checked that. Then and then again. He's got three heads. I should have been able to see that. Oh, well. That's okay. You did okay. Ooh. Yep, replenishment sounds good. For war. If we can finish him off, we will take a tiny bit of attrition. Medium casualties, seriously. We're going to have to fight that. That's going to be far too much damage to our fighter jet army. Or uh, I suppose it's not really fighter jets, they're more, um, uh, what do you call them? Attack helicopters, that's the one I'm thinking of. The old attack helicopter army. Dinocopter! Oh, let's get them in straight away. Into over you. there. You three up in this corner. No shooting allowed. Let's go. Dino copter. The clans, you know. Uh, you. You're gonna target Valmir von Death Guy. Oh, chariots are going down. Yeah, everything's getting hit pretty hard. That's good. Can spread some fire there. For the high king. Let's turn the uh, gyros around. That's all broken now. That's good. Lots of stuff already broken. Uh, this troll hammer torpedo one's just. Just do some wrecking. Lord is now dead. That's good. It's normally a good sign for us. Should concentrate fire on probably the dragon ogres a bit. That's what they're firing at, that's good. If anyone's going to do a lot of damage to them, it is them. Carrier 
chariots are getting wrecked. It's good. Chariots are gone. That's even better. You guys go after those Chaos Knights, please. You guys keep on them, actually. And you guys chase them down a bit. This is what I like to see. It's all being destroyed. Everyone's shattered now. That's the end of that army. Good, 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 good. And he's got gold chevron. Gold chevron now. So that makes him even more crazy with his damage. Take down a lord in mere hours instead of mere days. Yes, not medium casualties there though. Good, good. Uh, let's grab that one, just for the extra local happiness making. Done well. Oh, yeah, more control as well from him. And more control there as well. That's good. Uh -huh. Good, good. For war. And that, yep, went back in there. We're going to take a little bit of attrition this turn with him. Oh. Shall He's gonna head up this way. I want to try and fight that with him. Or that. That oh, mutilith vortex beasts. Jeez. That's gonna be a nasty fight. Now, what is our mission here? It's called the Fallen Ones. Okay. Only building has been constructed. Eyes of Grogan. Okay. Like I'm not actually seeing that in here. It's a bit weird. Oh. I'll figure it out. Uh, let's see. Engineer. Let's. Alright. Let's take him for a walk over here. Give me a moment. Corruption Ready minus 37. Jeez. Dwarves really have anti corruption down there. Right. No, what? There's the one. It's not home, but it'll be uh, province taken. Oh, that was some of those um, other. That was these ones. For some reason, it just opens up. A different quest thing. Okay, so once I've completed five battles there, yep. five thousand enemies in battle. Okay, cool. Managed to complete these ones. Yep. Okay, cool. Okay, this one. So we. Completed a couple more of these now. And this is all stuff that is good for gyrocopters. It is very good for gyrocopters. Okay. That's the only one I haven't completed now. More experience gain, missile strength, uh, 360 missile block, and yep, that's so uh, that's very good. What is this one? This one's all. It would only really give help to gyro bombers. I'm not using those at the moment. Okay, cool. Cool, cool. Alright. Uh, we want growth. Probably not actually. Let's go for control and anti corruption. Let's mark that building down and that building down. I like the extra replenishment rate that gives us. Recruitment costs lower minus three percent for them, minus three percent upkeep for them. Let's not worry too much about it right now. Let's do a bit of this. Uh -huh. He's not really getting much anymore. Uh, I think we should probably make you faster. Let you keep up with the rest of your army. Now you've done a good job. 
So yeah, let's take War Council. Uh, and we give you actually vigor loss reduction to right here as well. Uh, triangulation, Zufbar, 42 pounders. Guess what? You do the same. Uh, do we have any other points to spend? No, that's all right. So, yeah, whoa, geez, look at that strength. 252. No wonder they just fucking wreck shit now. Uh, let's go. They've got Malachi. He's doing his thing. We've moved you. Thorgrim. There you go. More gyrocopters for you, buddy. Buddy boy. Uh, I should actually probably upgrade. Let's upgrade both of these. I need to do more in the way of upgrading of these things. We'll repair that. We have one more turn of Confederation bollocks. And... I it up to there. But no, I can't confederate them at the moment. That's all right. We are a little way in there. I don't think we're going to get it. I think we're going to end up there. We just need so much now. What are the actual... We need 13,440 total. Fuck no, we need like half of all of our grudges again to get to the next one. Fuck. Alright. Anyway, so we are making steady progress down here. This is good. We've got a couple of provinces now held. And we have much more fighting to do before we're done. So we are probably going to head for the Silver Pinnacle next. Because that is possibly slightly less powerful. It's hard to say, really. With only one army down here, we're probably a bit short-handed. That's all right. The plan wasn't to just have one army down here initially, but, you know... Not all plans go to plan. There you go. Anyway, that is going to be it for me for now. I've been Ash Ninja. This has been Malachi McIason. I'll see you in the next episode. Hope you have a good one. I'll see you later.